everybody has got a door in their home like this, it bangs the wall somewhere. And I haven't done this yet. I've kind of been waiting for an opportunity to, to film it. They were using the same butter flavored crap, gook. But anyway, you could use anything. You don't have to go out and buy a tub of this junk to put anything on the wall. There's the old flour and water uh, wallpaper paste trick that works still. And, um, and of course, some wallpaper paste or wheat paste, they call it. So where are we? Got to know where we're going, right? Yeah, that wheat paste will hold the thing on the wall. Plenty, plenty good. And uh, when it's time to move, you pop it off. The wheat paste dissolves in water, and you call it a day. Anyway, that's our deal. Better than a hole in the wall. And now, if you wanted to. You can incorporate this in like a whole strip, like a, like an accent strip along the wall. Wrap it around a corner, or incorporate at some kind of odd angle. Doesn't matter. It's up to you. It's art. And part of the art is your doorstop. What I want so to do. So a lot of for not just fish on the menu at Bonefish Grill. Uh, Give it a try. You can check out the menu at Bonefish Grill. People with art cards, everybody's and seen them around. They have Cupid dolls or Smurfs stuck to them. Head to toe. I've got an old friend in Florida who had a Jeep covered with uh, beach glass and uh, seashells and that kind of rubbish. When you've been injured, and uh, we're going to go to my car. You can see this thing. I mean, this is a 94 Voyager. It's seen its day. It runs great, but the paint is beat, weathered. You know. And what I'm going to do is just kind of cover up the paint and get started. Do something a little different. This is saying you don't want to use wheat paste on this. I mean, this is a water, this is a water cleanup tile adhesive. But once it's dry, it's waterproof. Ideally, if you wanted this to be lastingly permanent and weatherproof, the circuit boards are weatherproof, fairly. At least for a good few years, anyway. You can depend on them maintaining their look. But a more permanent application might be uh, two-part marine epoxy, something along those lines, and it'd be good to go beyond forever or longer, beyond longer than the car lasts. The car will rot out from underneath it. 